teacher has been an alchemist this entire time and you didn't even know it. Lovely silver penny. I shall drop silver penny into the water. Give it a nice swirl. Pour off the water. Get me my penny. And put said silver penny. onto the hot plate and I have made gold. Now you've probably guessed that these are not actually gold pennies. They're not gold. Nothing about them is gold except for their color. And I am only so much of an alchemist as they were ever correct about chemistry. So if I look back over at my arrangement, I have a little tub of one molar NaOH solution. Doesn't have to be super precise. It is low molar though, and this arrangement that I have hidden over here involves a AA battery hooked up to a zinc electrode and a copper electrode, which I hold in my hand. The strange looking stuff in the bottom is zinc dust. Now, if I go through this again, I lower this into the solution and you'll notice that it isn't actually changing color. And as long as I do not touch my electrode to this penny, nothing's going to happen. But this is very hard to do one handed. All right, as soon as I touch it to it, it instantly, or fairly instantly, turns silver. Now what has happened is the zinc that is in the NaOH solution, the zinc ions specifically that are in the NaOH solution, are being reduced onto the surface of the penny by the electrical current produced by the AA battery. So now, this is an electroplated penny. It's been electroplated with zinc, making it a silver color. Now, we want to put it in the water because, well, even though it's very low molar, NaOH is very nasty. You do not want it on your hands. It's very unpleasant. Swirl it around in the water to dilute slash get rid of NaOH. Pour off our water, retrieve our penny, and as you can see, this is just water, we have a silver penny. All this white stuff is just uh, zinc oxide. Moving over to our very hot, hot plate. This happens very fast, so watch carefully. Lovely. And what has happened here, it happens a little too fast to explain, is the zinc that has electroplated our penny through here has now mingled in with the copper that was once the surface of the penny producing brass. And I'm going to be very careful. It's warm. It's rather warm. Oh, yes, very warm. Put it in the water. It's all good. So we have not a gold penny, focus, but a brass penny. So brass, like you know the stuff musical instruments are made of. So this is a physical process by which we have the zinc that has electroplated our penny mingles with the copper that was on the surface of the penny to produce an alloy brass. Lovely, happy fun times. Do, 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 do.
and this is how you make gold pennies.